equipping people with the best information in real time, whether it's video, data, uh, voice, or other forms of tactical communication, is, is power. It enables them to be safe and efficient and enables command and control structures that are as maximally informed as they can be. Public Safety LTE is um, the introduction of the next generation of wireless broadband technology. The introduction of private LTE is the ability to dedicate spectrum to public safety so that they can achieve broadband connectivity when they need it. So that when a police officer is responding to an incident, they can actually have access to video and information about what's going on at the scene that they're walking into. Fire personnel can also have information about the environment that they're working in in real time. Being able to pull down maps and information about the, the building, images of suspects. The more information that we can get in the hands of the people that are actually doing the job, how do we make them be their best in the moments that matter, get the right information to the right person at the right time and no more. I think LTE is a, is a transformational technology that makes that possible. In many ways, the technology doesn't solve the problem. It's the people running the network that solve the problem. And so the network should be a slave to their requirements. And that's what Motorola's purpose is. And when we deliver the end-to-end -end system, we grant those capabilities directly to the professionals that are out there saving our lives. There are several benefits that customers find in the public safety LTE solution from Motorola. Several of those benefits are based around dynamic prioritization. The consumer market doesn't have that advantage. For example, I have a Super Bowl and the carrier who covers that Super Bowl with LTE might have to face the fact that there'll be incredible loading during one event that might last five or six hours making it almost impossible for the police to use that frequency. When you have private LTE though, the control of how that bandwidth is distributed to police officers is 100 percent under the control of the agency using it. Secondly is the ability to prioritize users even within the police department. Motorola's LTE solution is a standards-based offering but then we're augmenting that standard with priority capability. The assurance to the customer is, is that this isn't just the one-time approach to putting an LTE for your system. What it represents is a never-ending roadmap of new features that we lay on top of standard LTE to make it operate and function the way that police officers need to see it happen as well as other fire and EMS professionals. Our Verizon Wireless Alliance allows us to bring true nationwide interoperability to public safety with the ability to move from a private LTE network to a commercial service provider-based LTE network. We've partnered with Ericsson, which is the world's largest LTE equipment manufacturer, to really create an unparalleled offering to public safety. In the end, you have the market share leader in the public carrier market in the United States, the global market share leader for LTE infrastructure and GSM and HSPA and UMTS, and then you combine that with the market share leadership in public safety, Motorola you truly do have a winning team. No one knows police, first responders, military, border patrol, homeland security, nobody knows those, those agencies better than we do. Bringing that knowledge that we have about how do public safety use cases unfold, what's important, you know, how do we get that right information to the right person at the right time, keep people safe, um, that's what Motorola Solutions is all about and that's what, that's what our LTE solution complements.